call the member for Holt. Thank you, Deputy Speaker. Uh, Deputy Speaker, today I again wish to use the opportunity to praise the quality, the enthusiasm and the capacity of our young people in the Casey region. Um, it was again on display in two recent events. Uh, one was a uh, Grand Prix event at Mosquil Park Primary School in Endeavour Hills last week. And another was uh, a visit by the City of Casey Australia Day students to the Australian Parliament this week. Last Friday, I had the pleasure of attending a special event at Mosquil Park Primary School in the lead up to the Australian Grand Prix. Students at Mosquil Park Primary School were invited to make a cardboard Grand Prix car and prizes were awarded for the best car and most money raised for charity by the students. Walking into the school, I was presented with an eye-opening display of the students' creativity. I saw a virtual car park full of incredible cardboard card uh, displays in every conceivable colour and configuration, and I mean every conceivable colour and configuration. I saw a brilliant red Ferrari, an ice cream truck that basically had speakers and was a six-person ice cream truck and was basically almost fully functioning. It's pretty heavy for the young student to carry around, though. Uh, so the, and, and a blue Transformers truck that wouldn't have been out of place in the movie itself. Amazing creativity from a young group of students. And, uh, and it's, I think it was great testament to the students, to the parents, and to the schools. And can I commend the parents of those students that turned out in very large numbers to support their sons and daughters, and the enthusiasm of the teachers, and particularly the principal, Jenny Scott. And I want to thank them for inviting me to this event. It really was a, a wonderful way of finishing off a, uh, a week, and uh, it gave me great confidence, again, in the young people in the area that I represent. Deputy Speaker, also, I was uh, delighted to uh, have a great discussion with some of uh, Casey's future leaders, and this was part of the um, City of Casey Australia Day study tour. Uh, we had any, a really fruitful discussion, and uh, as you know, with uh, intelligent young people that age, it can be quite some challenging questions that were put to me about the future of the city and, and Australian contemporary politics. There were 10 young people from Year 11, Leah Burrow, Trent Buxton, um, Arish Deep Dual, um, Mariam uh, Fariz, Jasmine Gonzalez, Liam Jalifi, Lauren Morant, Jared O'Donnell, Thomas Velikin, and Ulmiday Yinka Kahinde from Glen Eagle Secondary College. Very talented young group of people who were very keen to understand about parliamentary life. And <clears throat> as you know, um, some of these students can ask you very, as I said, penetrating questions and confronting questions, but they did the city a case in their parents' great credit. Two great instances of young people and young groups of people that show what a great area it is to represent. Members, time